and thank you for joining us on the Midday News. We begin this hour in the nation's capital, where the Court of Appeal seating in Abuja earlier today affirmed the election of Nasarawa State Governor Abdullahi Sule. The appellate court also sets aside the October the 2nd judgment of the Nasarawa State Election Petitions Tribunal that sacked APC Sule and declared David Ombugadu, candidate of the People's Democratic Party, winner of the governorship election. The three-member panel of the Court of Appeal held that the tribunal erred in law in concluding that Sule did not win majority of the votes cast in the election. Now, according to INEC, Governor Abdullah Sule pulled a total of 347,209 votes to defeat his closest opponent, David Umbugadu, who scored 283,016 votes. The tribunal, in a split decision on October the 2nd, sacked Governor Sule of the All Progressives Congress and declared David Ombugadu of the People's Democratic Party winner of that election. Now, Governor Sule, through his counsel, Wale Olanikwekun, a senior advocate of Nigeria, approached the appellate court, asking it to obtain the judgment of the tribunal. Our correspondent Helen Osamidi Ekings joins me now for more updates from the Court of Appeal. Helen, what are the reactions we are getting and what more do we know about this judgment or the verdict given by the Appeals Court? Yes, uh, Veronica, the, the reaction is something else. Even right now, we are still expecting the judges and the candidates to come out from the courtroom. They are still in the courtroom. But before the judgment was even given, outside the court, we saw supporters of both political parties jubilating uh, in advance, you know, not knowing what the outcome will be. They were so happy, drumming support for their, for their candidates. But as it is now, I'm sure before... And after now, go outside and see what is happening. The 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 the, the, the victory side would have they already know who won, and then the other party we have to you know take the whole thing with faith. Except the PDP candidate would want to appeal this case. He still have the right to go to the Supreme Court to appeal. Like I said, like you read in your in your in your report right now, uh, the APC candidate was earlier sacked by the tribunal in Nasarawa State. But the court today have overturned that judgment, saying that the tribunal erred by saying that the governor, which is Abdullah Isule, the incumbent governor, did not get majority of the votes. So right now we are still expecting the lawyers to come out of the courtroom to give us more, to throw more light on why this judgment is like that and the next step for the PDP candidates. And definitely we'll keep tabs with you, Helen, to get that reaction. And so we'll definitely come back to you as we get along with the news. Thank you.